everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Helen if you don't already know me and this is a really long overdue Birchbox video. This is the November Birchbox. So for every single Birchbox video I've kind of done an unboxing and then I've not really had an opinion on anything that I've used. This time I've opened it obviously and it is Birchbox times like Vogue, like this kind of collaboration and I've used almost everything in here. So, this is my favourite one actually by the way, this is this is definitely a good one. So when you open your birch boxes, by the way they're only like £10 and um, I enjoy it. I should, was thinking of cancelling it so I could save money but then I'm not buying any makeup per month at the moment so, anyway. The best thing in here, I should probably say that to the last but oh well, is the Hula by Benefit. So it is a mini, I don't know how many grams it is. But, like, it's a good size pan. I've used this a few times now. And because it's, like, a well-known brand benefit, like, it's very pigmented. You don't need a lot. So I think it will last a long time if you're not, like, stupid with it. So Hula's one of the things that this comes with. And that is a yes from me. The next thing, and I've used this, this is the Percy and Reed Smooth Shield and Sensational No Oil Oil. Anyway, it's a volumising oil, I've got it in my hair today, and I put it in my hair the last time I washed it as well, but I didn't blow dry it, it so it was just fluffy. Um, I guess uh, it's volumising, I guess, but I don't think it's made my hair smooth, but that could also be that I didn't blow dry it. Like, it was wet, I let it dry naturally, I put it in plaits, and then I've like straightened and decurled it today. Um, but it feels nice, I've got like, yeah, it feels fine, doesn't smell particularly nice, but like, I'm not going to rush out and buy it, but I'm going to use it, if that makes sense. So it feels nice, and oh, my hair needs a cut, so it doesn't feel that great anyway, but yeah, it's good. Um, another one that I have been using, in fact I've used, slash been using these, so this is James Reed Gradual Tan, and it's like an overnight sleep mask, and I've used this like for five times this smells nice that oil doesn't smell nice this smells fresh it doesn't smell like fake tan at all and it almost has like I don't know if you can see it's like a weird gel consistency I don't know how I would describe that oh and that actually will go brown it's one of those things that's like do wash your hands Okay, and I obviously didn't wash my hands that well after one of the times I'd used it and I did end up with the like nice brown tan lines in between my fingers. So definitely wash your hands. I believe the retail price for this is like £34 for a full size. I don't care that much about my tan to pay for that. And also, like, it, it no, I don't know, it, it is good because I don't wear makeup during the day when I'm at work because I work in a gym, so... Um, it is nice to have like a base tan and it is a type of thing that you could use every day because if you're washing and exfoliating your face then it comes off and you can be, I don't know, but it's expensive but it's good so if you care about your tan then this is good. Alright, this I have used, so this is Sesha Vit. I have never heard of this brand before and this is a dry fast top coat and I read it basically, it's almost supposed to like sink into your nail varnish and harden it. It's currently on my toes and it's been on for a week and they've just started chipping but I had this on my fingernails and normally my fingers chip within a couple of days working in the gym and they lasted for a week so um, I think it's good I don't know how much it retails for will I buy it no because I don't care that much about my nails so mm. um lastly I haven't used this as you can tell it's still in the packaging um but this is the birch box brush cleaner I will be using this because I've now almost run out of like clean fluffy crease brushes so I have to wash my brushes so I will use this so that will come in handy and this is my favorite 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 box ever so it's like 10 pound plus per, plus postage and packaging and because I'm using all of them so because I will actually be using all of them the brush cleaner 
this I use. I had to get this out of my bathroom cupboard to put it to be able to use it. And I've used this the last two times that I've washed my hair, and I'll continue to use it because I don't think it's going to do any damage. The hula is like a yes, 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 yes. And then Sechevite as well, I will use this as a top coat because I don't have a top coat at the moment, so I'm going to keep on using it. So is it worth £10 plus potion and packaging? Like, yes. And I would pay more for it. And then when you are a Birchbox member as well, you get like 10% off, I think, on, the, on items in your box if you do buy them full size. So that is my little mini short review slash haul on the November... Birch box times Vogue box. I don't know. Um, I will at some point cancel this so I save money, but I really don't want to. So, yay! Anyway, that's my Birch box video. I hope it's useful or helpful. And if you've been thinking about it, then you kind of know what kind of stuff. As I said, this is my favourite one um, so far, mainly I think because of that, the benefit hula. In all of them, in all of them, pretty much I've had something for hair which I just don't really care about to be honest and then I've had like a cleanser or a toner or something like that for the face um, there's some kind of makeup which is normally my favourite part of the box um, but everything that I've had from them I've used even though not like used and continue to use even if I wasn't massively excited when I first opened it I find all the little products just, yeah, useful. I'm going to shut up now. That's all. Okay, until I see you in my next video, stay happy and healthy. Bye!